Right, I'm just making this really brief um, little clip because I think it's important to address some of the things that the people have asked me about about uh, the footage that we caught several weeks ago um, and in particular the operating cross. I'm using the night vision to demonstrate mainly what the glints of light that appeared when the cross was moving in the cabinet on the original footage um, there did appear to be two I think lights um, they were not actually lights what they are is on the cross you can see there are four metal um, operating hooks that connect the string to the cross and then to the puppet um, and when you're using infrared metal as I mean you can see his glasses as well metal is reflective and so when the cross was moving, the movement that we captured when it was moving, those little glints you could see were those four, four little, little loops. I'll move the camera further away as it was on the night that we caught the footage because he, he's quite lit up here, more lit up than he was then. So you can't really see what I mean. So I'll move the camera further away. And then I'll come back to the puppet and I'll move the cross and hopefully you'll see what I mean. I'll just leave the camera here. So obviously I've had to take him out of the cabinet to show you this but um, I think it's important when evaluating things like this um, sorry I can't see anything when evaluating things like this that we um, we do discuss all the possibilities um, I've had comments from people saying it could be rat's eyes reflecting, uh, magnets, uh, I'm sure there were some others but I can't remember, but anyway, um, if I move across, I mean obviously I can't see what's happening but I'm guessing that what's happening at some point in the movement, that the infrared is making the metal reflect because that's what happens it may well do it with his glasses as well if I move him I'm not sure but, um... so bearing in mind that the puppet's actually not in the glass cabinet anymore maybe the glass um, made the reflection appear even more so um, I mean I can see there actually now that I'm holding the camera um, if I when I move it, you can actually see it does look like little lights just on that top metal loop of the cross. Um, you can see that reflecting. Those are the reflections that we saw on the original footage when the cross was moving, being moved um, in the cabinet. So, yeah, we we're still looking for either an explanation or or something else another occurrence some more activity would be brilliant we'll see <laughs>